and welcome. This is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swoosh, and I'm here today reviewing the Google. I called an option in this yesterday, and it ran right up, right up yesterday, and then followed through today. It was a nice, nice trade. Um, and in fact, people were asking about it in the room, and I reviewed it in the room. I said, you know what? This has a lot of time left in it for what I called it at, not to expire until next week, the 21st, and also it's got a big target. It's got a big target, but I said if you want to get out, you could have gotten out of the trade, taken it yesterday and gotten out of today and made more than 100% return on investment. But if you want to hold for a bigger move, hold it. So, in fact, let me just look here and just see. Actually, what this did close at. Actually, let me look at the market here. It's quickly how we close before I, that was good, that is good. Okay, so this was the 950 calls that I called expiring July 21st for Google. It was a nice call that I made yesterday. Early enough in the day that you would have been taking it and been up immediately. Actually, yep, 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 yep. This is still really close. This closed very strong. Actually, what? Yep, this is really higher. So anyways, this went almost five bucks through the strike today. So it, 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 had a, it, it had a really good move. I mean, it did have a good move. If you want to get out of it today, I, I, you know, you could have just gotten out of it. But, you know, you would have made more than 100%, but I felt this was really strong and really good. It had a nice target in it. It ran through the strike literally the day after I called it, ran right up, gapped up today over the resistance. I mean, there's, you know, this, one of the things I like about this is that it came to the point, fell, dropped, broke. Okay, this was in the market, was around the holiday period. Just came in a smidgen baby baby. And it's really showing its strength today. So I know it closed, looks like it closed a little weak in here today, but not really, okay? It just had a big run up and then came in a little bit before it closed. It doesn't take away from the fact that it did run up and it did gap up and it had a nice rally and, and it held, okay? So it just, it just couldn't hold itself into the close, which is not that big of a deal. So probably tomorrow morning, again, we have a lot of econ out in the market. This probably gaps neutral or up a little bit in this tail here thing tomorrow and then follows through. So you could look to take this. Well, let's just say I said 970. This potentially could go in the next week, but 960 really is the next number in here. So 960. A lot of this action tomorrow in Google will also depend on where the market goes with the econ and where the market gaps. There was news on Google this morning as well, which helped the gap up, but I called this yesterday, and if you didn't, you were up into the close and up a lot today. So if you're still in it, the big target is still in sight. You have to be a little bit of patient. The one thing about the options, if you're doing these with me in the letter and, and if you're in the room, and if you did the Golden Gap class and you're doing them on your own, you've got to decide. Do you want the quick exit as soon as you take it and you get out as soon as you're up, or do you want to wait? Wait, wait, wait for the bigger move. Or you could take out half and then hold the rest to the bigger move. So, you know, it's really up to you. But this looks good. And actually, the close of the price of the option looks good too. So despite the fact that it came in a little bit here in the afternoon, it doesn't mean, didn't really mean much to the option price. It's holding strong. Um, I think almost every one of these ones I've ever called in Google works. I, as I said to everybody in the room today, just every time I call this, Every time I call something in Google, just take it, take it, take it, take it, because they, they like all work. I mean, I read this stock very well. I just know exactly when to get it and, you know, just right on this thing. So good job to people that got out of it today. You made money. Um, if you took it and, you, and you're holding it through, good job with that too. Um, if you didn't do it, you got to ask yourself why. You got to ask yourself why. So, you know, it's time to get back in the groove here. Earnings season is coming. Tomorrow we got the banks. On next week, it's just tons and tons and tons of things. Now is the time to trade. Now is the time to make money, July and August, before the fall, and we're doing a good job of it so far. So good luck, everyone. Google looks terrific still. If you didn't do it, I wouldn't chase it. The best price was yesterday when I called it, and it was the confirmed uh, move to do it, okay? Because, again, well, the way that I trade, I trade gaps. I don't trade pullbacks, but that's a lesson for another day. If you're interested in the Golden Gap course and you want to trade with me, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. If you're interested in just the options letter just to get the trades, you can email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com and sign up for the options letter. 
If you want to make money though consistently, you've got to be in the trading room with me, which means you have to do the Golden Gap class. And I'm offering that free to the end of the year with the class this weekend. It's a great opportunity to trade with me, uh, just a super opportunity. And um, then you will learn everything that I do and how I rate the gaps and make calls like this in Google that just go immediately right up into the money. So this was a, a, a bullish call. It was a long uh, for the option. Have a great day, everyone. And email me at Melissa at thestockswoosh.com if you would like to sign up for the options letter or the class this weekend for the gap class. Have a great night, everyone.